There is a chill in the air. The arrival of the bewitching duo of Fire and Dawn. The following contest is a tag match set for one fall. On the way to the ring, the team of Alba Fire and Isla Dawn. These two women are self-proclaimed practitioners and scholars of the dark arts. And they're not afraid to use their dark powers to get ahead in WWE. Mischievous, devious, cunning, all part of Fire and Dawn's dark personas. The Unholy Union, as dangerous as they are disturbing. Fire and Dawn ready to conjure up a win. inside the ring. Let's go, baby! Hey, they dance as good as they wrestle. Go, Kaden. Go, Kaden. Byron, I'm a much better dancer. You know I've won many dance contests. When we see the dark duo of Alba Fire and Isla Dawn, we're looking at a team who's hungry and on the hunt for victims. When you call yourselves the Unholy Union, you're not exactly mentoring rookies. This team's not just dangerous. These women possess a power that has the capability to level the entire women's division. Fire and Dawn threaten to unleash scorched earth. And if they have their way, it can very well happen tonight. It would be wise for them not to underestimate Katana Chance and Caden Carter, though, Michael, because that's exactly when this dynamic duo thrives. And you just know, when Chance and Carter are thriving, we're all partying. Well, if you're partying, Saxton, then I'm not. Trying to talk with the back of the neck here. She's enduring some damage. Carter's tenacity worked in her favor. Fry quick to counter. Oh my goodness. Ah, what a smash. That is just insulting. Sweeps the legs. Crushing double stop. Kick right to the leg. Well-placed kick. Ooh, she just turned it around. And Caden was scouted there. Big knee to the midsection. And a well-executed move we just saw there. Just twisting away. From a seated position to a vertical base. Hooks the arm. Expertly applied suplex. And Cork, she can pin her opponent right here. She kicks out in one. Could be in search of a second win now. Watch her set up in the corner. Uh-oh. There's the backbreaker. 
And a hammer fist right across the collarbone. When you see a unit as aligned as they are, it's really incredible. Oh. Across the top rope, what a hot shot. Oh, no. Oh, look at the twisted into a leg breaker. Go oh, right to the kidneys. Golly. There's a tag. A tag made. Double team coming. Basement drop kick. Followed by a tumble. It's got to be demoralizing when you're the combatant on the wrong side of the double team. But will this be enough? Power right out in one. Impressive to not even allow a two count at this juncture. Legs caught. Oh, elbow to the knee. That'll hyperextend your leg. Knees meet face. Wearing down the knee. And an elbow, too. She thinks she has it. She breaks the count quick. Yeah, she probably knew that cover wouldn't do it. Uh, she's trying, trying to create space. What a forearm. Drop yeah, beautiful. She's tagged in. Yes, tag! She avoids the contact. Lariat, shoulders down. She kicks out with authority. Able to get that shoulder up so quickly. What a statement. Control. Shut up, Byron. Carter's legs are teetering. Uh-oh. What an elbow drop. That can do Carter in. Makes the cover. Archie picked up the victory. Picked up the victory. Here are your winners. The team of... Not for lack of effort, but Katana Chance and Caden Carter just couldn't get the win tonight. A bit of a cloud over Katana and Caden's parade with this loss.